For many of us, the worst part about grocery shopping is grocery shopping, wasting all that time in the store. But this could be a better option. Same day curbside pickup for all the stuff you need from groceries to household supplies. Target and Walmart going all in, now expanding the service to even more cities. You just order online and pick it up when it's ready. Can't go wrong, right? You never even have to leave your car. This morning, we are trying it out, ordering from Target and Walmart to see who gets it done first. Before you buy anything this holiday season, check this out. The stores make it look super easy in the ads. From our store to your car door. Pushing the service to make your holidays easier. No need to wind around the aisles. Just order online. Drive up. They load the stuff in your car and you're out of there. But does it actually work? Okay, we're going to try a little experiment here. This is my producer, Lindsay. Hey, Lindsay. Hello. All right, we're going to do some shopping today. Yep. Come on in here. I'm using the Target app to sign up for the drive-up curbside pickup service. You're doing the same thing for another store. Yep, I'm doing it for Walmart, and Walmart service is called Pickup, which is the same thing as drive-up, but they call it Pickup. Okay, so we're both going to order the same items, and we're looking for a couple of things. One, who fulfills the orders faster, Yep. and do they get it right? Yeah. Let's get to ordering. First, we fill up our carts with all the same items. Coca-Cola, 12-pack. Got it. From the essentials. Horizon Organic Low-Fat Milk, 96 fluid ounces. In my cart. To snacks. Oreo chocolate sandwich cookies. Yeah, also in my cart. To household supplies. Viva Vantage Choose a Sheet Paper Towel, six big rolls. In my cart. Time to check out. Target says the orders are usually ready within one to two hours. Okay, already a big difference here. Walmart wants you to reserve a pickup time, and the earliest one is not until four to five hours from now. So Target's saying one to two hours, Walmart's saying four to five hours from now. A lot longer. All right. And that's not the only difference. Look at the prices. When we order, my total from Target comes up as two thirteen twenty two. Lindsay's Walmart order comes up as one ninety nine forty five. Walmart is almost fourteen dollars cheaper for the same stuff. Okay, let's order in three, two, one. Let's see what happens. Target and Walmart both say they'll notify you when your order is ready. So I wait and wait. Okay, it's been more than two hours now and still no email from Target saying the order's ready and nothing on the app either. More waiting and waiting. It's now been four hours. This is crazy. Meanwhile, Lindsay's having trouble with her order too. Just got a notification from Walmart and it says your order was delayed. We'll email you when it's ready for pickup. But I have no idea when that's going to be. So she waits too, but not for long. Just got the notification that my order's ready. It's 40 minutes late, but I'm going to hit check in on the app to let them know I'm on my way. Lindsay heads to Walmart. Okay, so I just pulled into Walmart's pickup area. And on the app, I can let them know I'm here. Uh, I can also tell them what parking spot I'm in and what color car I'm in. So they know how to find me. And now I wait. An employee comes out with her order. Hi. And loads it right in the trunk of her car. That's all. All right, great. Thank you. Lindsay never even had to get out. But did Walmart get her order right? I know I'm missing one thing that they told me was out of stock. And it also seems like they substituted a few things, like these Oreos. I asked for regular, and they gave me the double stuff. But I'm okay with that. Okay, done. But I'm still waiting. After eight hours, no word from Target that my order is ready. So I give up and call the store. Hi, I placed an order for drive-up service about eight hours ago, and I never got a notification on the app that it's ready or not. Jeff Rawson. The order is ready? Okay, so what should I do when I get there and I pull up? She says I should have an option on the app to let them know I arrived. I don't even have the option to hit I am here, which you're telling me to hit when I get there because the app doesn't seem to be working. I just have to come inside and do it as a store pickup, but that's not what I wanted. That's right, the drive-up service didn't work. Okay, I've arrived at Target, getting out of my car, which I'm not supposed to have to do to pick up my stuff. Oh, and it's raining out. I pick up my order the old-fashioned way. Target telling NBC News, it strives to deliver exceptional service for our guests, and we're always sorry to hear when we come up short. Adding, drive-up is our highest-rated service by guests. Walmart saying the service consistently receives rave reviews, adding the service you receive isn't one that we ever want someone to have, but it is also not indicative of the overall program. In the end, both stores still have kinks, but Walmart wins.
Now, Target did get my order right, except for one item they shipped to me since they were out of stock. And by the way, we tried the drive-up service again at a different Target location, and it did work that time, so it seems pretty hit or miss. Bottom line, if you're using the service at either store, you may want to leave some extra time. Happy holidays. Back to you. All right. Thank you, Jeff. (laughs) 